The Cougars opening weekend was a blast, filling the CN Center and rewarding the fans with a great experience. On the ice, they were outplayed by Kelowna, but had a real chance to bounce back last night, welcoming the Swift Current Broncos to town. There's coach Mark Hollick and his team needing a better defensive effort than what they put up against the Rockets. We picked this up in the second period after Colby McCauley's first WHL goal gave the Cats lead. Coda Gordon tests Ty Edmonds, but he makes a great save. Then McCauley looking for more. Heaton Hayden Hopkins, a couple little guys getting in there, getting their nose dirty, get about 21 whacks at it, but they can't beat Travis Child in close. Soon after, Broncos captain Colby Cave finds himself in alone and makes a pretty move on Edmonds to tie the game at two apiece. In the third period now, Glenn Godden is going to go into the net there and crash into Edmonds. The Broncos think they've actually scored a goal here. But a quick call upstairs to the judge by the referee, and this one is ruled no goal, maintaining the tie. Soon after, local boy Chase Vitale is going to jam it by Child, giving the Cougars a 3-2 lead in the third period. But Swift Current again responds, kind of the theme of the game. On a 4-3 power play, Max Lejoie scores with a seeing-eye point shot from the blue line, and we're tied again. But then the big man, Mark McNulty, 6'6 six six defenseman, he weaves his way through and sends a bouncer towards the net that somehow eludes Child, sending the CN center into a frenzy. And then it's Tyler McConjic. He's going to find a loose puck in the slot. Make absolutely no mistake on this one. The Cougars get their first home win, 5-3. We talked to McCauley after the game about his first WHL marker and the game itself. It just comes, comes to you and when you get it on your stick, you just want to put it in the back of the net. And tonight that happened. We got the first one of the season then it kind of uh, went on a downhill slope from there especially uh, from Tri to Kelowna here but it was good for myself it was a moral victory and also a team victory and the team played awesome so it was a great win. Going into a big weekend here going to Spokane and Vancouver a couple of good teams so get some momentum going for the boys and gets a good start.